was um how i lost my smartphone and how i ended up using a dumb phone and um what i discovered during that time and i'm also like using my dumb phone let me show you guys my new phone this is my new phone it's a nokia angazi um nokia bani but eh, this is now me so uh how i lost my phone is i was doing shopping and whilst i was busy shopping i put my phone in the trolley my car keys and my purse so when i paid go check out i took out my plastics keys and purse and left my phone somehow i don't know how and then the moment i realized you could see my phone is not with me i quickly went back to look for it and it was gone like you know so and uh, when i tried to call it it was off i was so devastated guys like i was so disappointed and the thing is i'm always losing phones and that's why these things happen to me but um with this one i'm a content creator Kabanga, we content creator you don't have a phone you guys understand my pain ne? and i use my phone to edit because it's faster or oh, i thought it was faster and then now i'm thinking vlogtober is almost here because these things are happening to me but um little did i know like my pastor has been preaching uh, things are not happening to you they are happening for you so um i didn't know that this was happening for me to help me realize the bad habits that i have and uh in that process and also just trying to reevaluate where i am and what am i doing with my life so firstly i realized Uguti, when we have our phones we are always carrying our phones we are not involved we don't see people we don't hear people sometimes you answer just to dismiss someone especially with the kids and if you know kids bala and the little one also is now um at that phase la mama 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 you know so now that i don't have a phone i see people i hear conversations like i look people in the eyes and, and make eye contact you know and I, it's a shame Ugutsing and Bella, we live in a world where we are so consumed by social media and whatnot but i also do want to say Uguti, i don't want to put smartphones as um like the culprit lana a culprit is wena and self-control i obviously didn't have self-control because i couldn't control no limit my time with phone so another thing is um i sleep better because sometimes when i can't sleep i'd say ngalal and when i can't sleep i take my phone just to keep myself busy then it adds two or three hours then anglali on time so i think that's another bad habit that has fallen off so as you guys can see i'm kidding so um yeah so i can sleep i can focus like i live in the moment i am in the moment i see people i hear people but one of the biggest thing that it has helped me with is my finances you guys know I always speak of being debt free and 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 so what I what I found out besides being debt free I found out you could have bad habits bad money spending habits so because I don't have a phone um I'm banking with Capitec and those who have Capitec would know good see before you can make a payment online you have to um confirm it on your phone so with a smartphone so i didn't have that option and i misused i see now that i was misusing it so every time i pay 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 and i never look at my statement and just to recap because in my mind guys go to what i'm spending my money on so now i don't have a smartphone i can't make payments so it means i have to have cash in my hands and then i have to feel money in my hands and i have to um feel money leaving my hand you know i have to see myself spending so um i had to pay in aftercare seekers aftercare and then what did i have to pay oh i had to pay accommodation it was three things that i had to pay and then i had sleeps most oh i had to pay the guy from gym because i had bought a pre-workout um 
what do you call it that that mixture pre-workout so everything was now in slips and i'm looking at them they're in my bag so every time i want to do something there's like a there's like a proof so i felt so bad when i was looking at the slips you could see this is how much money i spend because now i have to take out cash so that i can make payments and i felt like yo i was like not aware i thought in jayoguti i salary ipelang is speed you know ganti it's just bad habits so when i was looking at the slips and just touching money and um seeing money like spending a thousand a day and then the next morning i have to go withdraw it was it was crazy to me and i didn't realize um such bad spending habits and to tell you i'm not even like kidding i have not touched i have like my account where my money goes and then i have savings that i always take out maybe i was 15 or ninin i have not even touched that and i've like you guys know like i've done email stock i've done everything that i need to do and i have not even touched email okay it's six but i would know by now but say, oh, oh i'm just putting that money i'm gonna take it back you know putting it taking it back i've not touched it because i'm fully aware so for me that has been a blessing you know um and another thing the blue light effect um my eyes got strained so much because of um just constantly being on the phone and i get headaches and whatnot so now with the camera and another thing for those who don't know i have a camera that i bought that i'm using right now was not using it because i felt like it's inconvenient i have to take it out and whatnot but what i found also in that process is that using a camera to vlog helps me a lot because it helps me to plan you could see if i'm going to the gym i'm going to take part of the se um session i'm going to vlog so i'm very intentional about it it has helped me with planning um i take it out i film i take it back and i always remember i have to charge it it sounds these things sound simple, but if you don't practice them, um, you realize once you practice them, we could say planning and just um, being aware of your money spendings, small things, they make a huge difference in your life. So with my Vlogtober, it's been smooth. I would say, let me just whip up my phone and vlog again. When, um, like I'm just, I know if I'm going to spare the like i intend to vlog or not so i've loved that aspect of just being able to plan a content and i realize what um other content creators mean when they say that you plan your content uh also i love the idea of just um switching my camera off and just relaxing and going back to life so with the phone i couldn't do that because i'm constantly on it and another thing also i keep, i feel like i'm saying another another thing are cool but um what has happened also i found that with my phone it will be full like i literally take five videos it's full so with the camera i take videos i change cards i do it with computer it has allowed me and bella guys to be effective and also in j not have a stress because it's stressful when your phone when you're trying to download a video and you want to upload right now and it says full and you don't know what to delete you know that moment when you're desperate and you want to delete the bible on your phone and you're like yo is a resale. i'm sorry god then you delete like i would feel like that but manje i'm just using elon your computer now what i love about that is using a computer um to create content is that once i switch off my computer it's shut down i don't have to go back to it so i'm uploading at half past five for vlogtober once it's off it's off i'll see tomorrow when i switch it on i love that for myself there's a discipline that i've um mastered all because in jay i'm not using a smartphone so with the smartphone i'd constantly have to be on my phone checking how's the video doing oh they liked it oh and um youtube studio i was always on it because i would be looking or would say um oh i gained a subscriber oh somebody unsubscribed so it was very um sorry it was toxic it was not good 
and again it goes back to self-control i was not um able to control again my time on social media but ever since i don't have a smartphone life has been amazing it sounds dramatic but it has been amazing and in that aspect especially with my finances just being involved uh, being present and hearing people looking people in the eyes and just making a contact another aspect that i love so much is um being able to call people and p letting people call me as well what do i mean by that with phones, Nabo WhatsApp, everything is just here. You talk even when you you don't have anything to say. So making a call is re like it really has to be important for you to call somebody. So it has limited also my time that I spend in kumintengazazi or making conversation engai anywhere. So I know that if somebody calls me, it's important. If I call, it's important. And even with the bay. I, we didn't i didn't even realize that we don't even call each other because of ugabon messagings and 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 so it was just so nice to get a call and you're thinking yeah now ugabon so um it's one of those things that i wanted to share nani uguti if you guys would also like to challenge yourself especially those who have control uguti smartphones are built with um ama apps that will help you um to shut down or do not disturb and whatnot those things i highly recommend that you do so that you can have a positive um effect on your life and i it sounds drastic and very dramatic could type all this from a phone but because our phones control our lives so much i think um it is that serious and i wouldn't talk in jail for the sake of talking i i wanted to share this because i was like you know what so many negative things as in zega when we are always on our phone even when you're driving when you're at church when you're at church so what i did is i went again uh, to go uh find a uh, look like search for your phone get one and see was the reasonable price and whatnot when to Vodacom and MTN and iPhones are expensive, brah. <laughs> so, anyways, I and then I was like, no, I won't be able to get a phone on contract because I'm just not trying to add more debt to a uh, army and I do not find like I don't see the necessity of getting but the 800 and something for a phone. A month for three years as if in patali model but that's just me so i was like no i don't wanna i don't want i don't want things i want me to pay for things mang fu now you know um so that option was out of the window because i was like no ways bra and patali nishi motong so patali phone so um then the option the second option was buying cash and i'm like there is no ways I am a savings arm, especially a Elon La like a serious for thank you phone that's over like 30,000. I was like, no. So when I went to game, because luck is always on my side, I found out you could see they lay by phones, which I didn't know. So I lay by it an iPhone. I actually wanted an iPhone 10 because it was cheaper, but the lady convinced me, oh, good see. I see there's a fly. Then I remember Michali. <laughs> um, she convinced me to take. I think it was twelve. So I lay by it. Then I'll pay it. I think over a space of three months. Then I can have a phone. But I've decided, Uguti, this one is gonna be my main phone. I'm gonna use it. Uh, and then the other one, the iPhone. I'm just praying and I'm hoping, Uguti. I'll just use it when I need it for content because another thing with not having a smartphone is on my apps you are you really see how toxic things are you know, like about Instagram, Facebook and 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 I had deactivated Instagram Facebook I think for three years so went back to them but only with computer so when I switch off NASA switch off and they're not as addictive and as nice as when you're on your phone you literally can't you know when you're on your phone everything is fast like 
So Jay, life has been on that slow pace in terms of just being consumed by all the things that we see in the internet and 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 so I um, I think I'm going to end it here. So guys, let me know if you do struggle with your phone if you've ever had like a method we would see how you are gonna um limit your time we phone and if you have self-control please let me know i know there's a lady who is yo lawyer sisi we are yega a phone and she'll just look at it like the whole day and we got used to it good if if it's important you call them so um let me know get to do you have a self-control do you see e smartphone as as being a problem what's your story please let me know in the comment section but otherwise for me it's nothing but love please remember to like subscribe comment and share this video with your friends i really appreciate you and i will see you guys on my next video Ta -ta.